Hey, it's Erica. Welcome to more Red Dead Redemption. Uh, oh, why is there a stranger mission still back here? Um, can I redo it? <gasps> How we ended the last part? How do I even get back there? Girl, this is the wrong way. This is the wrong way. I'm gonna get back there again. I wanna see if it'll let me redo it. It's weird. Sometimes, like, I saved the game or whatever, Whoa, but. Ooh. Not even this way. Um, sometimes I see the game, but then it still will play whatever kind of last thing I did. It'll still give me the option to do it, so. Whatever, we can go and try and ride our wrongs, I guess, if the game's gonna let me. But hey, hello, it's Erica. Welcome to more Red Dead Redemption. Hope everything's going really well for you. Uh, I don't have $200. Uh, yeah, it's gonna let me do it. Um, we should just, just for the sake of continuity. There we go. For the sake of continuity, how I ended the last part. Um, yeah, I, my Saturday was pretty good. Well, I'm recording this on a Saturday. I don't know when you're watching this. Um, wait, no. I'm just starting to shoot out in the town, girl. Thank you, Senor. I should know by now. I never took out a man who has an Avega Pequena. I couldn't just pass by and let him kill you. Funny. Oh, who? I mean, it gave me more honor. I don't know how. Oh, they're shooting at me again. Okay, um, but let's see what we're gonna do. Yeah, this one we're not really gonna do too much of. In the last part, I said we weren't going to, just because it's like collecting more things, and I don't want to be sitting a whole part collecting things again the flowers was like i feel like enough like i don't know if we need to be <laughs> running around collecting things like crazy you know um so yeah that's uh we're gonna kind of leave that treasure mission to its like self i guess is the best way to say that um but we have luisia don't we yes oh you know what i really spelled her name wrong <laughs> when i was tagging the video whatever you can't even see the text it's fine Hi! Who's shooting at me? Is my horse? They were shooting at me! How do I lose on? Whatever. Yeah, my Saturday is pretty, pretty nice. Pretty good Saturday. I watched- Ooh, I finally watched Jury Duty. It went viral like a year or two ago, I think. Um... Yeah, just because, like, it's, like, this guy, if you don't know the concept, highly recommend you watch it. It's, um, this, they get this guy, and they tell him they're doing a documentary on the jury trial process, but everybody's in it is an actor, except for him, so it's kind of, like, his experience of going through jury duty with all these crazy situations and these actors, and James Marston is in it, um, and he's great, he's funny, he plays, like, an exaggerated version of himself, um, but yeah, I think the show is great, and it was just so wholesome and sweet, and like, the guy's like such a sweetheart, and it's like, you're never gonna be able to find somebody else like that. Like, that's a one-season show, you're not gonna be able to find somebody um, that's gonna be that genuine, that sweet, you know? Um, just that type of guy, you know? Um, and to not be able to like, figure it out, I mean, he kind of like, yeah. it was... You able to get like oddly suspicious at times, um, but yeah, ultimately it worked, and they gave him like, well, I don't want to spoil the ending for, it, but it was very wholesome and so sweet, and I loved it. I don't know. Sometimes I need just like very wholesome, heartwarming television, you know, entertain me that way <laughs> rather than this way. Jesus, I picked the wrong games to be heartwarm, heartfelt. Yeah, I picked the wrong games to have like a heartwarming experience. For sure. <laughs> but I know how it is. There's heartwarming moments, you know, that really kind of just like warm my sweet little heart because John is, is a sweetheart deep down. He's an awkward to rugged man. Yeah. Boy, if you don't stop. If you don't stop. Like, he's doing this whole thing for his family, you know? So that's very, very sweet. 
But it would, like, I, it would be nice to just play a happy game once in a while. Just, like, fun happy times, you know? <laughs> Instead of, like, <laughs> play the worst ones for fun happy times. Maybe we just need to come back. Then we need to get more fun happy times games. Rather than just, like, moments in games, fun happy times, you know? And not everything needs to be so serious or, again, life altering or life changing. Um, but yeah. Oh, they burned down your house? Oh, Mr. Marston. Mr. Marston. What's wrong, Louisa? I don't wait for myself, but for my country. Abram Reyes has been captured. He has? Oh. See? Heartwarming. He was coming Heartful. to meet me at Roca Madera. It's a very romantic spot. It was a beautiful night. Yet he was ambushed by patrol. My heart is breaking, but I cry for Mexico. Uh, where is he being held? Oh! El Presidio. Oh. You know, in our hearts, we are married already. Oh. His family do not approve. How could they? Well, I'm little more than a peasant girl. But that's what makes Abram the man he is. He doesn't care for their bourgeois, snobbery, or elitism. He sees the real me. The woman. As you should. As you should. I'm sure. I'm going to go and rescue him or die trying. Uh, Lisa? Oh, whoa, whoa. I don't think that's such a good idea. I'm a job. Ride with me to near the jail. We'll figure out how to rescue him. Ride with me? Oh. How romantic, John. You are truly a friend of this land. This game's gonna be followed in love with so John Marston. Everyone keeps informing me. Or Jim Milton, sorry. Keeps me falling in love with Jim Let's Milton. Let's go, Mr. Marston. Are we taking the wagon again? Sweet. Is she driving? Is she driving? I wonder if, if there's any dialogue, we'll listen to the dialogue. If not, we'll skip. But that's so sweet. Yeah, no, John is like. It's very interesting, right? Because they never beat this game originally, but I know everything that does happen, so I'm familiar with John, right? But I guess it, it was much more of an experience with him in Red Dead 2, which was, like, obviously me falling in love with Arthur Morgan. But this one, I'm like, I'm falling in love with John Marston. Like, I can't, I can't help myself when they're so sweet like this. Uh, you got to. You got to. I mean, come on. And we are almost there. He is still alive. I feel. I just skipped because I, I didn't think there. If there was a dialogue triggered already, there was gonna be. Plus, we get to get on with it. This is part eleven. I can't even really tell where we are within the game. I wonder. Does the journal tell us? Does the journal tell us how complete we are? Challengers. Failed girl. I know. I failed that one. Um. No. Stats. There would, there would be. How far are we? Oh, we're almost halfway through. So, I'm yeah, like maybe like a 25-hour game? Okay, but that's like full completion, I feel like, and that's not um, everything. So, we're probably over half. There may be, there's probably like three chapters. There's that first kind of America section that took us like, what, eight parts to get to? Yeah. And then there's probably like a Mexico section, and then there's another section of the game as well. Um, we did 24 new Austin missions, that's crazy. Um, and we found 36 to 45 new Austin areas, really? And there's 94 areas total? Okay, well then getting those maps was really worth it then. Um, purchasing those fame. I'm a mercenary, honor, peacemaker, sweet. Um, total time, 10 hours, yeah, about 11 parts, that definitely makes sense. Um, about 11 hours, so... Uh, yeah, probably around like 20 to 25 parts. It seems like we're gonna be working with here. Maybe maybe again It may be closer to 20 just because um, the, Even though it says 40 almost 45 percent. That's not that's like completing everything and we're not gonna 100 We're not gonna 100 percent this one We're here for the story El Presidio. There it is. You have to find the way in. I'll do my best. Me. There is a partially broken down wall you should be able to scramble over it. Part four. Hurry, but please be careful. There are guards everywhere. If they see you, they will kill you both. Well, if he's alive, I'll try to make sure he stays that way. Mm. I have some friends waiting for me near the river. Bring Abraham there. Good luck. All right. Finding Good the way luck. in. Que Dios te How do I crouch? There we go. Oh, there's a 
Sneaky, sneaky. Well, I just have to get over the broken down wall, right? Watch out, parkour! Get to the sniping position. What? Hey. I got a I got a rifle with me, don't I? Let me make sure if it's a sniping. Oh, I don't got rifle ammo. God. Same thing that I don't have pistol ammo. Damn it. A uh, Springfield rifle then. Oh, there's one right there. Never mind. 86. 86. 86 means like just forget about it. Nothing. Sniper rifle ammo 20. <gasps> John, why would you do that? John, get back up. <gasps> oh my god. I messed it up in the Two seconds. It took me two seconds. Accidentally jump over a wall instead of reloading. Sometimes it's square, you know. <gasps> not again, not again. John Marston, not again. Oh my god, again. We're gonna keep that in there, aren't we? Yes, we are. There's one thing about me, we keep our mistakes. Where? Oh, where? Oh. Oh no. Oh no. TNT. Hit the TNT. I don't even know how to zoom. Oh my god. Old controls were not the best. Oh, and I died. I should have taken cover. Must a savior die? Okay, this time I promise I'll get it. And I'm gonna leave it all in because we did fast travel to this location. Take some cover. Somewhere there's a TNT. Oh, they got done. Let us, uh. We got some medicine for a reason, don't we? Drunk. What are you doing? Alright then, I was just gonna jump off the thing, but I'm still gonna jump off the thing. Alright, let's get ammo. Repeat our ammo full. We must escape now while we have the chance. Yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. Now please come be free, senor. My revolver and my repeater ammo is full. Luisa sent me. We I have to beat her by the river. Ammo. Yes, Luisa, the girl you're marrying. Oh, yes, such a devoted thing. El amor de mi vida. Get one of those horses. I will ride with you, compadre. Why does it seem about her? If it's not about her, why am I doing this? You know? Come on. Whoa there. Let's hurry to well, let's talk about teleportation. Oh, 
Okay, this horse sucks. Luis has sent me. Vamos, get the prisa. The army's coming. All right, let me make sure I have. Uh, no. uh -oh. go, 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 go. I was making sure I had proper something equipped. This horse is not built for running at all. Need I see more in front of us? Hey. Also, I could probably just run past him, right? Hey, come on, get on the path. Get on the path. Let's see. Hey. John Marston. Oh, the American who was working for Allende. I ain't working for nobody. I'm here because Luisa asked for my help. As I thought you were a friend of Allende's, I was planning on putting a bullet in your back. <laughs> well, try to resist the urge. How do you know my young lover, Laura? It's Luisa. I saved her life not so long back. I will not forget this, compadre. Can I see you? Rewarding money, women. Luisa, if you want to. Oh. I'm here for two men, and that's it. You've been spending too much time with Captain De Santa. Very funny. Not like that. I'll explain later. <laughs> I am free again. I will write a poem about this day. This is from a man who was tied to a post with a gun in his face a few minutes ago. I wish I could see Allende's face when he finds out that I defeated a hundred of his men. You? Luisa is a fuckhead. Buena suerte, compadre. I don't like this guy. He doesn't remember Luisa. He doesn't. There she is. I remember her now. Mi amiga. Come on. I don't. I'm not liking his vibe. Abraham. Mr. Marston. Oy. The revolution will live on thanks to you. Yes, indeed, John. You are as a brother to me. And my people need a man such as you to help our cause. My ranch is in Agave Viejo. Mm. And let me say, my brother, that we await you. Well, best of luck to both of you, but I need to find two men so I can return to America. Mm, no problem. I will help you find those men. And in return, you will win a people her freedom. Viva Mexico! Bye, young. Vente conmigo. Tú sabes que en esta luz puedo ver el fuego en tus ojos. I see the appeal. Laura, dame la fuerza he said Laura para again. luchar. And she did not care. He has a good singing voice, though. 200 fame, hey. All right, the next mission we have is the De Santa one. I don't. Am I really gonna be fighting for like the freedom of Mexico? <laughs> like the situation John gets himself in is crazy. They're crazy, girl. All right, that did take me a little bit to beat, but it's all right. Uh, yeah, we can go ahead and ride on over. Why don't we? We definitely need to go to the gunsmith because we need Let's go. sniper rifle ammo and pistol ammo. That is for sure, Z's something we need. Like one hundred percent need. But yeah, I'm enjoying the game. Like playing, like again, almost well, probably halfway done with it. Um, yeah, I already sort of have an opinion that you should play this one first before you play the second one. They're just kind of like totally very different. Um, and I like I feel like if you play Red Dead Two and that's like all you know, and like you never go into this one and you never kind of cared to dive into this one, then it's like, then I don't think you'd have an appreciation for this game. So, like, linearly, within, like, the story of playing Red Dead 2 first and then this one, I think, yeah, it can work, but it's, like, only if you kind of are aware of this, you know? Um, but if it's, like, your first time playing, and you're like, I kind of want to dive into Red Dead 
Redemption, you know, always heard about two, how great it is, and I remember always hearing about one and how great that one was. I would say Go. this one first, even though I'm playing it sort of opposite, kind of, you know? Um, yeah, because I don't even know if you can have, like, I don't know, it depends on what type of gamer you are, you know? Um, but, like, this one, it just, yeah, the tone of it are just, like, so different. This is, like, it, like a... I don't know, it's just the tone of like the western vibe of this one is so different from the western vibe of the other one. Um, and John and Arthur are just like so completely different characters and it's like, you know? That's at least how I see it in my eyes, that's what I would recommend to people. Again, it like really depends on you personally and what you're looking for, I feel like, out of the games and what you personally experience and what you personally take away from it. Um, so that's not like a 100% set in stone fact, like, yeah, you have to play this one, and then you play Red Dead 2. I just think for the appreciation of the characters and the love for it to do it, you know? But I don't like... That's how I feel, personally. Because then you get just like... You play this and then you... Or you play two, and then you play this, and it's like, I don't know if that same yeah. feeling of... Vengeance? Is the same? And I don't even know if that's the right word to use. Or that sort of feeling, but I don't know another word to describe the sort of feeling that you get in that game based off, like what the characters are and what happens to the characters, you know? And I, yeah, again, and like, I hope that saying vengeance, I don't think saying vengeance is a spoiler, but also I don't know exactly what other word to sort of use for it. But if you play Bolt, you know what I mean. El Senor! How are you? Hey, partner. Mm. Buenos dias, senor. I see you know Fire your bomb? guns. Okay, let me see. Pistol ammo. I am at your service. Uh, do I just have to, like, literally spam it like this? I'll just buy all his pistol ammo. And then, let me get a couple of these. I'll get, like, three. Yeah. Mm. Oh, that's just rifle ammo. Okay, sniper is something different. <gasps> oh, yeah, I'm out of ammo. <laughs> okay, um, a semi-automatic shotgun. $500. Girl, why did I spend my money Esta everywhere noche, else? Voy a comer panochita dulce. Okay, I'm out of money now. anyways. We are broke. Nos vemos otro día. A hundred. Wow, okay. And then... 34 that. We got a lot of ammo now. Girl, we're ready to do some damage. Whatever crazy thing Vicente is going to get us into, we're going to be prepared for it. We're like, we're kind of like, it's interesting to be on like both sides of a war. But, like, morally, John's not taking a, a stance. You know, he's just, like, helping people. In general, it's not really mattering what side he's on, but it's, like, it's all in benefit of himself. Like, who, I guess, he's gonna back up whoever gets him to Bill and Javier faster, you know? Mr. Mustang, ride with us. We've been betrayed. Hmm? What's happened? If there's no time, ride with us. Then we'll find the main you seek. Come. Promise? Waiting for us. Just outside Escalera. Vamos. Am I too ahead of him? Where'd he go, though? Where did he go? Easy. Los rebeldes tienen una fortaleza ahora. ¿A dónde vamos a parar? Abraham Reyes tiene un verdadero ejército. Dicen que hay cientos de hombres apostados a Torquemada. Creo que somos muy pocos. Cállense la boca, idiotas. Son campesinos nada más. Les y todos se van a morir hoy. Captain Espinosa has set a camp at the base of the mesa. We will join forces with him there. Uh, I don't think there'll be dialogue here, so I'm leaning towards skipping to destination. I'll give it a few more seconds, see if anything pops up, but I I don't think so. Especially because we said it at the beginning. But at the Mesa, which Mesa? I don't even know where I am. I don't know. I don't know this map too well. 
All right, we're just gonna skip ahead. I honestly don't know what I'm gonna play after this. Wake up! We're drawing near to Torquemada. I'm thinking. I do want to play Horizon Forbidden West, but that game's gonna be long, and I don't know if I want to play game. How about that feeling about this? Keep my eye out, okay? Oh, oh, that got me. That scared me. I. The ridge too long. I, I, I get him. That scared me. Hey, well, right faster, dude. Should have had me drive. And we know how well I drive. Let's see what mess that idiot Espinosa has made. See that deranged captain at Tesora Azul? Is he leading this attack? He? Spinoza does not lead anything. I thought you was the same rank. He is an angry dog we let out to run sometimes. That is all. I'm in charge here. Yes, and like it. That was sarcastic, by the way. But yeah, I think I'll probably play Spider-Man 2. I don't want to get like too far away from playing the Spider-Man games. But I also want to play Forbidden West. But I know that game's going to take so long. Follow me. We will leave the wagon here. And I kind of want to dive into Spider-Man 2 before I kind of dive into another long type of game. Donde carajo están los otros que necesitamos? Nos van a masacrar con estos pocos. Me verdes que tú y tus hombres se habían habido encargado, nos atacaron. Ten cuidado con ese tono de voz, basta. Come on, ignore the stupid idiot. Shut your mouth, office boy. Gringo, take that sniper rifle over there. We have men's work to do. I guess we got men's work to do. What are they doing all the way up here? I am losing all the In a situation where he gets stuck on both sides of this, or like gets caught in the middle of it, because now it's like we're helping. Oh my god! We must hold the line. Baboso! You're dead. Muertos. Where are they? Okay, here they come. I. Right. Okay, this is not what we need. John. Really? fight back and that they actually take guys down because there's so many times where you play with people and they don't they don't do anything and I'm literally killing 50 people I by myself oh I need cover you take the snipers we can hold off the rest Oh, this is a bad spot to be, bad spot to 
these. Damn it. I knew that was gonna happen. Where does the checkpoint be? Okay, not too far back. Not too far back at all. We have a strap! Kill the snipers!
It's interesting that I feel like the further away shots, it doesn't count for like the blue drop. Oh. Yeah, hurry up, Hobie. Tengo hambre. Lo que sea, mujer. Amigo! Amigo, que pasa? Uh, kill it like you, uh, deserves fine women and wine. The best pleasures Earth can give a man. <laughs> I need some information, DeSanta. Oh? All in good time. <laughs> uh, my man and I will finish our business here, and we can talk back at Escalera. The next time I see you, I need some answers, Captain. Oh! <laughs> go get drunk, go get a woman! Enjoy life! It's a beautiful struggle! <laughs> Sean is very much standing on business now, and I like that. I like it. All right. I wonder what's next for us. Maybe it is the DeSanta stuff because, um, yeah, I don't know. There wasn't like other mission pop ups, and this is a longer loading screen, so I'm like, what? Pokemon. A hundred bucks. Can buy more ammo with that one. By mistake, sir. Let's go. All right, where is the, what is next? What, oh, some stranger stuff. Oh, are we gonna get all those stranger ones? Then maybe this is like second to last. No, maybe not. It doesn't look like there is a sound though, right? Easy. Yeah, but there is another stranger one. So let's go ahead and do that one. Um, it still wants me to do it, but I, I keep killing him every single time. Then we're not going to worry about that too much. We can just ride over. Ride on over to Escalera. You know, or we're going to fast travel because that is all the way across the map. Um, really? How about right here? Oh, I'm caught in my bed. Really? All right, come here, horsey. Where'd he go? Are you stuck? Are you seriously down there? What? Are you kidding me? Okay, can I just slide down without dying? I think I could. Like, no, I cannot. But I think I'm stuck here now. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna have to die. I'm just gonna have to die. <laughs> because I made a mistake. Oi. <gasps> My horse died, too. That's crazy. My spawn back. Which, which house is this? I don't remember. Although, okay, like halfway, I'm like halfway. Okay, well, kind of. Kind of. Let's see if it'll let me do it here. I, I may be still in town. Nope, I'm in town. I don't want to take a carriage because I got to pay for it. And doing the campsite thing is free. So, yeah. Here. We should be good here. It's like when you're like an inch out of town, then you can do it. We're going to Escalera. There we go. All right. Let's get a job with the sniper rifle. Why am I a disc? Okay, whatever. Just kind of Alright. I'm thinking, yeah. What my thought is, is this may... I don't know if this will be the last one in Mexico, but hopefully next time we do get to Javier. Or... Bill. Or something like that, you know? We're looking for both of them. I don't know if we're gonna get both. That's the thing. Not positive on anything 
other than it's raining in the game, and I'm really liking what we're doing. Seven a.m. and six p.m. What time is it? Really? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go back to sleep. See you in a second. My mistake, mister. My horse hurries up, I can get this one this time. Yeah. Let's go. Am I gonna be able to get this guy's horse this time? I think it's a different guy. Maybe it's the same guy, who knows, he just pops up in different areas. Is that him? I don't get nothing from it? I did all that just to get nothing. All that trouble. 21 dollars, that's a lot. Alright, what time is it? It is... 2 a.m. I was thinking... I could try and gamble. Ooh, there's some dice up here. Let's see if we can play some large dice. I like that one a lot. Hey, come on. Oh! I can't? I wanna play. Let me play. Fine, alright. See you in the morning.
All right. We should be within the time frame. Mexican Caesar. Cesar? Ande las lindas y patrióticas. Dale, que ustedes son putas y lo saben. Por favor, no me hablas. Oh, mi amor, nadie te está obligando a hacer nada. Solamente quiero que animes al hombre que va a salvar a tu padre. ¿Tú quieres a tu padre, cierto que sí, linda? What's going on here, Captain DeSena? Just a little recruitment. Nothing for you to be concerned That's about. That's not what it looks like. You boys using women soldiers now? Our customs are none of your concern. Apparently not. The Santa Mariconcito! Me encontraste algunas chicas. Ay, mamacita. ¿Dónde has estado toda mi vida? Ven, ven, mujeres. Ay, me gusta. It's two patriots were keen to make your acquaintance, ah, the coronel. Fantastic. I love patriots. Ah, hey, Sergeant Marston, you here to fight the war? And we shall make a patriot of you yet. I hope so. <laughs> Any word of those men? Oh, yes. I heard they were riding with Reyes. Really? I wanted to talk to you about it. Really? Uh, the Santo, uh, hable con él. Tell him what I wanted. Huh? His Excellency, El Coronel, would like to employ you in escorting a train down rebel country. The job is dangerous. But you'll have the honor of... <laughs> Another patriot? Of knowing that you said Mexico in her fight against forces that would destroy our society. How much you offer? 20,000 pesos. And information as to the whereabouts of Javier Escuella. Okay, then. Mexico loves you, Mr. Martin. She has a funny way of showing it. Ew. Hurry, we must go. All right, uh, we're doing this now. How much is twenty thousand pesos? Like, andale, a chuparosa. In nineteen, whatever. We're gonna chuparosa. I think we can skip this one too. So it looks like it is me and you again, Gringo. And there was me, thinking my dance card was full. What do you mean? Just that it's a pleasure to see such a noble patriot at work. Your sarcasm is childish and pathetic. This is an important assignment. Our orders are to deliver these munitions to Chuparosa. They will help to finally crush the rebels. I hate to break it to you, Captain, but I think you're gonna need a lot more than this. I know. Most of the supplies are already in Chuparosa. We will deliver them all by train to our base camp in Diez Coronas. Our forces are close to establishing control in that region. Why didn't DeSanta come with us? Why do you think? Because he is hardly a soldier. I'm sure he has other important business, like mailing letters and sweeping floors and flirting with firemen. He fought with you Are at you Torquemada. Are you defending that pathetic little Aaron boy? I did not see him fight. Without me, we would have lost the battle. He knows less than nothing on how to lead men. Yet he's the colonel's second in command. That is a good job. You are a funny man, gringo. De Santa licks the colonel's boots and plays with his waiter friend. That is all. I am Allende's brazo derecho, his right arm. I am one of the few men he respects. Is that right? You and him have something special, do you? The colonel needs a maid, a woman he cannot fuck. De Santa is that woman. All right, then. What is our true dynamic? I don't know. The battle at Torquemada was hard, but the Soro de Azul, now that was some fun. Am I right, gringo? Fun? Burning people's homes, killing innocent people? That's your idea of fun? When a woman picks up a rifle, and a child picks up a rifle, they become soldiers. Those are the rules of war. They ain't my rules. So you would allow a woman to shoot you? That makes you an idiot. Not the gentleman. You confuse me, my American friend. You want our help to kill two men, yet you have a problem helping us kill men. Your morals are ridiculous. I gave up morals a long time ago. I just don't take pleasure in burning down houses. <laughs> it is funny you judged me. Does it seem quiet? Yeah, it's kind of like, like, where is Ron's morals? He... You tell me. He has we have some. not seen a single rebel yet. I'd say that's a good thing, wouldn't you? 
I don't know, yeah, what's kind of a big question for me is still where is like John's stance on. Oi! Like, what is. I didn't even get to do anything! Wow, okay. Is like, where is like John's stance on certain things, like morally? Like, I think it's defending his family ultimately, and it kind of. I don't know, like, at whatever cost. I don't even know if that's a proper way to describe it, you know? Because that's why he's doing everything. So, he at least has that to him, you know? But, like, in terms of, like, how he's helping other people, there's not really anything morally that's happening now. I'm literally trying to pull out my gun. It's not letting me. Wow, okay. Oh god, that was crazy. Good one. I cannot see any more of them. Alright. Are we like halfway there? That was close. I don't know. This doesn't feel right to me. We're on our way to escort a train through rebel-held country. An ambush feels about right to me. Soldado! ¿Quién eres? ¿Cuál escuadrón? Somos nuevos reclutas, Capitán. Es nuestra primera asignación. I knew I had not seen these men before. They are new recruits. En escalera, people have been talking about the rebels planning a large attack. If these supplies are so important, why have we been given so few soldiers? Don't ask me. You think you're trying you're to take captain. them out? I thought you were supposed to be fearless. I am fearless, but not brainless. There is I wonder something if it is wrong. a setup I to try and get it. this guy killed. Maybe you just need to take a piss or something. The colonel told me that the Santa had praised my actions at Torquemada and called me a hero. He asked for me to be given this important assignment. Why would he do that? The cabron hates me! To yeah, get you killed. But doesn't everybody hate you? Maybe we should turn back or wait for reinforcements. If Valende says he knows where Javier Escuela is, we're doing what he asks. I thought you obeyed orders. I... It's another ambush! But I under... I, why am I riding with them? Why is he trying to get me killed too or what? That's a crazy thing. Is if he's trying to get me killed. Yes, it seems to be on schedule. At least one thing is going right for us. You know? I agree. We ain't off to a good start. You shoot well, gringo. Tell me something. What is your weapon of choice? What do you mean? Come, oh, my friend. Your belt is full of weapons. Which is your favorite for attacking a man? We are close to Chuparrosa now. I still have a bad feeling about this. Tell me, why are you here? What did they promise you? 20,000 pesos in Javier Escuela. That is a lot of promises. Do you know where Escuela is? You think I am going to tell you that before you have fulfilled your obligations? Do not take me for a fool. I've given you no reason not to trust me. You must understand why we are suspicious of you. Most I've American literally done so much. Come here to help the rebels. It is strange you have chosen to work for the army. I'm not working for you. How many times do I have to say this? Call it what you want, gringo. We are exchanging favors then. I ain't seen many favors come my way yet. Yeah. Abraham Reyes is trying hard to recruit gringos to fight for him. His propaganda is everywhere. He promises women, gold, and of course you've got money and a chance to interfere in business that is not your own. How can any American resist? I've done everything you've asked of me. If Alinde doesn't give me a Escuela and Williamson after this... Why does the dialogue just cut off sometimes? Like, I kind of wanted to hear more about what John's going to say. Last. Volados! Abordamos el tren! But yeah, if I'm John, I'm tired of being tired, like, tossing around in Mexico.
Back on the train. I do not think we have seen the last of the rebels. You recruits can't win a fight like this. I need you to man the Gatling gun. I ain't the soldier here, Captain. Do not question me, gringo. Just do as I say. Damn, okay. Oh, on the Gatling gun oh, again. The alerta. Get behind that gun. I am not taking any chances. I hope you know how to use that gun. Can't be that hard. Just point and pull the trigger. For you, we will all be killed. Don't worry, Captain. I've used one of these before. For a cold-hearted killer, you're an anxious son of a bitch, ain't you? We have already been ambushed. Our squad is made up of new recruits and the two men that Santa hates the most. I think it is right to be anxious. Me? Yeah, well, I wasn't me? exactly expecting a pleasant picnic by the seaside myself. Why would he hate me? He said too many hates the most. I didn't know that. I mean, well, I don't even know. Hang on, really quick. I need to pause it. Sorry, new recording. New recording session, I should say. Over there! It's the rebels!
I also had a Twitter every time I had an affinity train for the Rebels, I had a Come back from this. Did you want to kill him, or should I? No. Until I find a squaler, he's more used to me a lot. True. True that. Look at that view, though, girl. Here we are. Thank God. We are lucky to be alive. Yeah. Go to the camp. The base commander will want to speak to you. Dios mío! Sobre... Senor Marston, thank you for your efforts. The escort was a success. At least some of your men survived. I didn't think to survive myself. My whole life I have dreamed of a glorious death. <laughs> Vamos! Rapido antes and uh, Kenos attack an ultra base. These socialist pigs cannot be allowed to win. All right. I asked $75 for that. Is that 20,000 pesos or what? Yo, I are not be able to purchase from the store. Okay, we got another DeSanta mission. That's like all that's really popping up for us. So, yeah, if we do not get to Javier... I might be a very upset girly. Oh, look, there's a funny man mission over here. Hey, it's been a minute. Mm, we're going to go ahead and go over there again. Or at least go over to the waypoint. Let's see. Campsite. See what is in store for us. I don't know how we got to Mexico, but he's here with us. Um... So yeah, it'll be interesting to see what he has to say for this one. <laughs> Alright, where's he at? Buena. Somewhere over here. You know, I sing, but I can't sing. That's the thing. Come here, horsey. No point in naming the horses anymore. Learn that out very quickly. I wonder if there's even a way to keep the same horse that you start with. Where is... Okay, it... I don't wonder why it put me all the way over there then. Like you could use an extra gun. Oh god. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Right there, that I just die immediately upon impact. What is that? Why is it? Why is Jimmy in this situation? You know, like what is what? 
hopefully it kind of like checkpoints us to like around here the start of this mission wow the loading screens have gotten a wee bit longer a wee bit no but i'm all over here okay there's a stranger mission here yeah, okay, then I'm assuming the last one is going to be, um, uh, this one might be the last mission in this area then, if, um, excuse me, if this is, if we're getting kind of straight to pop-ups now. Excuse me, sir, excuse me. You are an American, are you not? Last time I checked. Oh, thank God, sir. Thank God. I have had it up to here with Dagos. Up to here. The savages. Mm, well, I do what I can to help. But this land was imagined by an angry god for an angry people. <laughs> well, America ain't exactly a peaceful paradise, mister. Well, um, I tried, but well, at least you lot try to speak bloody English. Uh, this bloody lot, my God, if I'd wanted to speak Spanish, I'd have gone to Spain. You're in Mexico. Why didn't you? Uh, good question. Well, you know, business, I suppose. <laughs> Devil making work for idle hands, what? <laughs> now, uh, now, listen, friend. If you were to go west to Nosalida, I'd give you a reward for picking up a package of mine from the docks. Hmm? Now, there's, okay. there's some fighting broken out there. Uh, it seems like it's more your kind of thing. Why would I want to do something like that? <laughs> oh, you Americans are all the same, obsessed with bloody money. Well, I will pay you, sir. I will give you a buck. Names Tollitz, sir. Uriah Tollitz. Oh, they'll know Sounds what like in toilets. Nosalita. How much? Plenty, sir. Plenty. Uh, you will take it and give it. To the foreman of the estate at El Matadoro. He'll be expecting it. <laughs> Try to give that. Okay, alright. I got tired of hearing him talk. Alright, so we have that one. And then we have. So I have to go to the docks. Oh my god, that is all the way over there. Okay, but we do have this funny man one I still want to do in this part. So we'll do the funny man and then we'll do. Um this one and i believe that's it honestly i don't think i'm not seeing really any other strangers but yeah i'm not seeing any strangers ones so yeah Sorry, at mister. least well at least do this one and then whatever hey, amigo, i died do you want to make some money Ven conmigo. what is it the same guy They're delivering provisions to the market. You steal one of the wagons, I give you good money. Oh yeah, it is the same guy. I am back, partner, before I shoot a hole in your head. Stop really? I me. got a bounty? Oh my god, first time in this game ever. Wow! Oh, I guess it'd be like second time, right? Alright, we're right out of the way. I'm not surrendering, that's crazy. No. I can't believe this is the second time I've been wanted in this game. Well, I guess a lot of the missions that we do are... Are they crimes? Question mark? You know, we're kind of in the law a lot. Or what is the law? You know, whether it's the army or if you're helping the sheriff, you know what I mean? Versus, like, when you play Red Dead 2, like, a lot of the missions you get wanted. So, yeah. But we can pay off that bounty because we have get out of jail free cards. Alright, let's do this. Is 
Sometimes puts the dog like down. Yeah. Some help. Gracias, amigo. The pendejos killed two of my men and captured another. We must save him. Mm -hmm. Got it. Yeah, that's better than just breaking down the doors and just jumping in. Oh, in the house next door, though. This is a little too visceral for me. John, what the hell? I did that without even doing the thing. Well, because I missed it, so. Alright, did we clear up this area then? Tesoro Azul, Tesoro Azul complete. Cool. I don't know if we're, like, conveniently getting all the areas, or if there's, like, I'm sure there's areas I haven't gotten. Alright, let's go talk to Jimmy. Oh my god, dude. Really? Let me let me open this first. Oh, damn sport. You really are someone to be riding the river with. I think you've done outstayed your welcome down these parts, old Jimmy. <laughs> I get out while the going's good. Oh, you're right about that. There is something about nearly dying several times that hasn't given the old this is the second time in this situation. the situation that I was expecting. I can't write a joke for a pile of fresh turd. No more of this cowboy business for old Jimmy. I think I might take up music or war reporting. Probably music. All right. Don't drag this out. I think that's gonna do it for this part. In the next part, we're gonna finish out that other thing by the this thing, uh, poppycock. Uh, we're gonna finish that one out. But for now, that is going to be it for this part. We cleared out an area. Um, yeah, we have these two stranger ones that I, we're, I'm not too concerned with. I keep like failing this one. But it still wants me to pay, but I don't want to pay 200 bucks. I don't got $600 anymore, you know? I spent it all on ammo. Um, so I'm not really too concerned with that. The other one is, like, collecting a bunch of stuff that I'm like, ugh, I don't even know how to get, like, killing birds and all this other stuff. So we're not going to be too worried about it. Even though it would be cool to see whatever that is fly. I'm not too concerned with, in terms of collecting everything. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for this part. If you did enjoy it, don't forget to do YouTube things. Like, share, and subscribe. Really does help out a small channel like mine tremendously when you do decide to show any ounce of support. And I genuinely appreciate any ounce of support you do decide to share with my channel. So thank you so, so much. Love you. And I will see you in the next part. Bye.